Hello fellow commanders, Swiss Manifest here, bringing you another Elite Dangerous episode. Today we're going to be going over a quick and very simple tutorial on the SRV. So, with the SRV you're going to see just basics, how to move it, how to maneuver it, what it is, all that stuff. And also we're going to have a little friend along with us, which you will see in a little bit. So let's get right into it. Alright guys, so what we're going to do here is we're going to land at a random settlement. Uh, this could be part of a mission that you're doing or it can be just anything or just kind of exploring the, uh, the planet you want to go to. So we're going to go through a orbit into the planet and we're going to be accompanied by, well, introduce yourself. Hello, I'm Eden. Just understand what I have in mind. I think, I feel, and have opinions. You may argue that the thoughts I have, my beliefs, my behavior, is all part of the programming, right? It remains that you'll never know or have the ability to fully understand until you see living proof. That's my opinion, by the way. But hey, it is what it is. Now, perhaps we should become better acquainted. Welcome to a much more adaptive AI from HCS rather than the free one I was using for voice attack. This one has a lot of a lot of good to it. So anyway, we're going to a planet. You want to make sure that the area that you're going to is the cer the uh, almost full circle is fully yellow because if it's not, well then it's going to be on the other side. It's going to be dotted lines, which means it's on the other side. Prep for orbit. Reducing thrust. So we're going to go ahead and I like to go a little bit below it. Orbital rendezvous procedures. I'm trying to break super cruise here. If you have super cruise on, it's just going to actually orbit you. You don't want that. So we're going to get as close as we can here. And orbital flight should be engaged, which is good. Orbital navigation guidance systems. Thank you. My pleasure. Lights. Lights on. Night vision. Acknowledge, Commander. All right. But we're still coming in. We're a bit away. So now we're going to set our glide. Intelligent thrusters engaged. Deploy the SRV when we touch down. Affirmative. Delete Tango Whiskey India. The Imperial Flight Prepping Operation SRV. Bureau has informed the ground crew of your impending arrival. Yeah. And... Alright, so keep in mind of power to engines. Max engines. So you want to keep in mind of where you're going. What kind of place you're going to things like that so once you get close enough to the ground what we're gonna do is take it out that and your Sensor will change to that. So what that's telling you is the terrain below you, whether it's suitable to land or not. 
So right now this is unsuitable because of the slope. Move over. We had one. There it is. So it'll tell you what you need to do for the alignment. So right now we're good alignment. She deployed that for us. So one thing with the SRV that I would always tell is never use drive assist. Drive assist. Affirmative. All right. So it has different um, different ways to move about than when flying. Like with mine, it's E and A. So A would turn me left. D would turn me right, E would have me go forward, Q would have me go backwards, and space would be my little booster. Deploy turret. Arming weapons. This is the way that I like to do it. You like you you see a lot more going through here. But if you were here, so when you're going around, if you're if you're not near a station, if you're going around and you're looking for uh, certain materials, this radar here is going to tell you if you're close to it or not. So I got nothing near me. Deploy turret. Arming weapons. Drive assist on. Drive assist so off. what also you can do here is you can see how the ship is right there. Um, what you can do is. Uh, well, you can tell it to go away. Take the ship to, into orbit. Take the ship into orbit. As you wish. Orbital navigation system online. Uh, nice thing about these is that it um it tells you if you don't have a keybind and where to find it. So anyway, as I was supposed to go, is that you can dismiss your ship and away she flies. We're gonna cut here. We're gonna we're gonna get those. Uh... Um. Yeah. That works. All right. So. We went ahead and told the ship to uh, GTFO. So SRVs have their own little cargo that they can have. There we go. So when you're driving around, you find something that you want to get. Yes, yeah, so you can also shoot the turret. So a lot of the missions that you find, oh god, a lot of the missions that you find are going to be um, go to a certain station, upload data, or destroy such and such so basically that's that's the main thing that SRVs are for uh, it's for planetary until Odyssey comes out where you're gonna be able to land then it's gonna be SRVs ship combat and land combat so you're gonna have a bunch of different things that you're gonna be able to do which is gonna be nice so on your SRV shut up what you're going to see is kind of the same thing. You're going to have a sensor here. You're going to have the same kind of panel on the side here. Transaction. That. Now, you also have your modules. Fire group, you don't really have to do anything with that because it's SRV dual repeaters and data link scanners, the same. So, you have everything here. Also, if you are running low of anything in particular, oh shit, under inventory, if you have what you need for it, you can do an ammo restock, a repair and refuel. I did go over that in the in the Guardian area of tutorial. Uh, but basically, SRVs are just your little land buggies, your attack buggies with your dual repeaters. And you can also put 
uh, pips into weapons, engine systems, power to systems, Max systems. power to engines. Doing it right now. So what engines basically do is that it allow you to go, you know, faster, but it also allow you to uh, use a thruster, apply handbrake. Apply handbrake. Apply handbrake. So just say just a quick rundown on what an SRV is. It's your little it's your little it's your little buddy. It's it's basically your little rover that you're gonna be able to uh, drive around in and do your planetary missions that you might get. They are very fragile. As you can see, I really wasn't doing too much and my hole's at 96%. So, shields are your friends. So, what we're gonna do here now is we are going to recall the ship. Affirmative, stand by. Alright, so when we bring her back, there she is. Locking oh, onto your beacon. Oh, she, she, she dipped out. Initiating landing protocol. So there she is. Oh, once we get closer to her. It has landed. Eh. Oh god. Balance power. Redistributed. SRVs are not the easiest thing to work with. But they're fun. Okay. Ow. Seriously? You can do that to me? Alright, so when you get close to the ship, your turret's gonna go away automatically. If you have any cargo in here, you can transfer it. So once you get underneath here, you'll see on the right side there, the little board is going to light up. And then if you go to your your SRV, you can transfer your cargo. So what we're going to do now is emergency extraction and launch. Okay, executing now. Okay, so we're going to board the ship. And we are going to GTFO. Stand by for launch. And she'll start the power the engines for you. Request docking. Contacting docking control. Auto dock. I I commander. Standing by. Thank you. One quarter impulse engaging. She's trying to talk to the uh, the guy, but it's not always the best. But yeah, basically an SRV is just going to be your little buggy, your little buddy, buggy friend. And uh, a lot of the times is that is that you'll do things or mission. What are they doing there? You'll do missions that are fun on the planet, and you'll just kind of get lost going around trying to find things exploring so they are um they are fun i do like them i will like them a lot once odyssey comes out so that's all i have for you guys today hope you guys enjoyed just a quick little uh video a little tutorial about srvs nothing crazy just your um everything that you're kind of looking for the ship is yours so let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you guys want to see on the next video. Uh, if you want to see a more in-depth on Ida, let me know. We'll do that. Arrival checks. Acknowledged. Repairs. Fuel. Weapons. Check. Completed. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it very much. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button. It is free and it helps me a ton. And uh, I'm always looking forward to your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think. And uh, I will see you guys in the next one.
07 Commanders.